Okay, we got more than one. So, I've only been fighting one at a time, so... Oh, come on, come on, come on. He dropped something on the ground. I saw it right there. Sir? Oh, you can search him. He's got a freaking pistol. Okay. Hey, welcome back, everybody. The Accidental Survivor here. And we are back with another First Look Friday game. Uh, this time the game is called Humanit Z. Um, and this game here kind of reminds me a little bit of Surrounded as far as the way it looks. I don't know very much about this game at all. Just from what I've seen briefly on Steam uh, as, as the, um, you know, the playthrough stuff. But uh, it's a multiplayer game, but you can play single player as well. And uh, we're going to go ahead and try that out. So here's the single player. Survive alone in the infected world. Rebuild what is left. Make your mark. You can do multiplayer, you can do scenarios, fight off hordes, race against time, survive as long as you can. That sounds interesting, but it looks like it's locked. Like I might have to do something to get that open. But this is an early access, so that may be coming later. Uh, and they have a survival guide, and of course the settings, I turned the music off. Now we're going to go with single player. Hey, it looks like, looks like Dwayne the Rock Johnson there. <laughs> um, so we're just going to go ahead and, uh, let's see, oops, new A game. Yeah, it, this is my A game. <laughs> No, accidental. Good enough. Let's go ahead and start game. Um, would you like to play the tutorial? No. Because I'm just going to go in and see what happens. Airdrop every three days. Permadeath is off. Okay. They do have airdrops. Clear infection on death. Clear infection. Yeah, I mean, if I die, I don't want to have an infection. If I'm still infected, I mean. Uh, zombie difficult is default. AI difficulty default. Zombie amount multiplier, one. I'm going to leave it as is. I'm not going to adjust that stuff, um, except for, you know, the clear infection. So let's apply all that. Finish to survive. Oh, hold on. Um, if you notice, most of the games that I play are, um, you know, either first person or third person. So let's see, starter located. Spawn star. So what do they have the choices? Inland spawn, nice location to test your survival. Tough place to spawn, Seek Zeke's not far. West Road Spawn. Limited items. Lots of nearby Zeeks. Um, starter Spawn. You know, let's go with the starter one. Okay, I see. The mouse. Uh, can I zoom in a little bit? Okay. Yeah, yeah see, the stuff like these kind of games here, they always I always get confused on the direction that I'm running. And you got to use the, the keys to go in the direction, not necessarily the direction you guys face. And so I can put the key down here, but I have them facing this way. So... <laughs> Um, so what do you do? I mean, do I, like, can I search these items? Let me zoom out a little bit so I can see what's going on. I don't like that I can't really see, like, what's over here, you know, even though I'm standing right there. All right, let's, uh, let's get into the house, see what happens. Open? How do you do that? Oh, F, okay. So, will they give me icons to, to search items? Oh, I see a backpack here. Okay, F to, to grab that. So here's my... Oh, these are my pockets. Okay, I got former survivor letter, and I've got an apple. So this backpack... Gray school. Okay, I put it on. All right, I was wondering... I pressed F, and it, like, kind of opened it. And we got a hose. So let me see my inventory. Um, okay, tab is my inventory. So that's my pockets, and now this is the backpack that I just picked up. Okay. There's weapon slots. Um, there's a slot for armor, gas mask, helmet. It looks interesting, you know. I I, I got to admit, I'm not like I said. I'm not a fan of the of the of the style of how it. <laughs> oh my god, of how it looks, but it does look like it could be a fun game. Search trailer. Oh, okay. This is what's in the trailer. Oh, we got some food. Can I click this over? I can. Got a screwdriver, a bandage, and a compass. Oh, thought I heard a freaking noise. Okay, so that's, uh, I'm unarmed still. I don't have any, uh, let me check my weapons. Or my items. I got a screwdriver, hose, let me, pockets. So you can't drag these items down. Like if I'm, oh no, I don't want to put the bandage on. Oh my god, I just put a freaking bandage on. That's not what I was trying to do. I was trying to just see if I can switch it. Here's a rock right here. 
Can I throw that? So all I can do is punch. Okay, let's zoom out a little bit. I mean, the graphics look great. I mean, I have no problem with that. Okay, let's search the van. All right, we got a... Uh... Okay, so right, right click to consume. Left click is just to switch it over. All right. So can you drag stuff? I mean, you can, but yeah, you don't need to. Can I put that in my hands? Swap. None. Okay, maybe that's not a weapon. Maybe it's more like a resource. Why oh, you got your... Oh. <laughs> okay, I can kick. Oh, wow, look at all the houses here. See, I can't really see. I gotta, like... I gotta do this to find out what the heck's going on. Can I search this car? Open vehicle. Okay, can I drive this vehicle? I mean... I don't know if it was possible. See, like, where's the front door on this house? I have no idea how to... It's locked. Yeah, I mean, I can't even see if there's a door because I have, I'm have i I'm stuck at this angle. But, I mean, for people who like these kind of games, I'm sure this is... It looks like a good game. You know, it looks like it would be very interesting to play. <clears throat> Maybe there's a door on the back. So There we go. There's a back door. That makes it a little easier to see. Damn, that's locked too. All right, there's some stuff over here. Do I have to be like super close to this stuff? Oh, here we go. Search dumpster. Uh, we got rope and barbed wire. I'll take that. I mean, my inventory is almost full, but eh, it's just a it's just a, tr a game to try. You know what I mean? It's a it's a new game, and I I wanted to try it, even though I don't like these kind of games per se. You know, the top-down ones, I do want to try because it, it looked interesting. Let's zoom out a little further. Okay, we got a roadway. Do we have a map? Okay, we do. So there's buildings coming up here. If I keep going this way. There may be other houses, but I really can't. I mean, there could be a house, like, over down in this corner. If I just keep, like, going over here. But I, I just can't see it at that angle. Or there could be a cliff. <laughs> All right, can I run? Why is he always looking that way? Oh, there we go. I can run. Okay, I can't search this car. I'd really like to find uh, some kind of weapon. And see what the zombies look like, too. Let's get in a little bit closer. There's something in the back. A box of nails. Okay, what, is el what else is that? What is that? Starter motor? Oh, is that for the vehicles? I think it may be. Yeah. I don't even know what vehicles uh, are drivable. And what did I see over here? All right, anyway, we got, uh, we got these other houses coming up. Or maybe they're just cars I'm looking at. Oh, there we go. You can add gas. Oh, here we go. Oh, what does it say here? Vehicle parts. Okay, it's got a starter motor, 64%. What is this one at? Let's go ahead and swap. It doesn't look like I need a battery, a fuel pump, and a fan belt in order to get that stuff going. Okay, I just wanted to check. Let me, uh, I want to get rid of that uh, motor in my ve in my inventory if I can. Okay, let me zoom out a little bit so I can see. <laughs> I don't see any zombies. I can't see the... Oh, there it is. I, was like, I can't see the front door. Oh, man, all these doors are locked. Why is he in that fighting stance? What is this? Fuel pump. Oh, I don't have any in inventory space. All right, hold on. Let me really quick. Let's uh, go ahead and take this. We're going to drop that. And, um, I'll hold on to everything else for now. Although, let me, let me drop those stones. I just feel like I could find those things anywhere. Okay, let's take the fuel pump. I want to see how this works. That's why I'm playing. I don't know why my guy is still in his fighting stance. But that's fine. I got a feeling like I would, I just feel like I would run faster if he wasn't. Maybe that's, maybe that's standard the way it's supposed to be. I don't know. 
So okay, so let's see here now. Let's uh let's get this over here. Okay, there we go. We got a fuel pump and we got a starter. So we need if we find a battery, a fan belt, and some and some gas, we can get that vehicle going. And uh, does this thing have storage in the back? Like where we can put stuff? Open. Oh, we do. Oh man. Okay, let's get the rope, the barbed wire, the nails, this, the pocket watch, the hose, screwdriver, and let's get a little bit of the food. We don't need all that food on us. Okay, so we got a little vehicle here. We were getting uh, put some of the items we're carrying. Let's get back over to this house. Let me go around the back side. See if there's anything back here. <laughs> God, I really oh, I hate this. Not being able to see like right now. I cannot see what's around me. All right, we never actually went in the garage. So let's uh let's go in here. Okay. Oh, here we go. Ten crossbow bolts. Let's see where we got a ge we got a gear, sheet metal, purification tablets. Okay, that's for I guess for water. Washing machine. Oh, there we go. We got pants, a biker jacket, and gloves. So we have a shirt on right now. Let me see if I can swap these. Uh, it says swap. No, I don't want the washing machine. Okay, let me go back to my inventory. Okay, let's get that there. And there we go. We'll do that. And we've got blue pants. And here we got green pants. Uh, I'm not going to mess those up because that may be my pockets. Let me see. Maybe not. I don't know. Yeah, I still got all my stuff. All right. So what I'm going to do is I'll... Let me put this stuff back in the vehicle. I want to see if I can get into this house somehow. You know, there, is there a way to like lockpick or break the doors down? But let's get let's get back over here. Uh, there we go. I'll throw the shirt over there right now. I'm gonna wear the gloves in just a second. Let's get these out. All right, that's I want to make them together. I gotta look at that letter. Hold on. Let's hear. Uh, if you found this letter, then it's been too late for me, but maybe it won't be too late for you. I hope by writing this letter, the next survivor who finds this will have a better chance than I did. It's been a while since the outbreak. The human numbers are getting less, and the infected seem to grow stronger every day. What humans are left are either after something from you or will kill you for your gear. Oh, supplies are dwindling as the remaining survivors scavenge the island. I bumped into a few traders during my travels. They always seem willing to strike a deal. I used... I used to try radio communication to contact them, but there wasn't always someone on the other end. With what fuel was left and parts taken from other vehicles, I managed to get the odd car up and running, which helped get around this big old place. Every so often, I would hear aircraft fly over, and I think maybe dropping supplies off. To, that's right. Every three days, it said there would be an airdrop. They seem to have stopped since the radio tower stopped working. I've made green locations on the map for you, to, for you but you'll need some parts for it. One item I couldn't get was the radio receiver. When the outbreak first happened, the military was brought in, and I managed to find some remaining gear and weapons at outposts and camps, which helped protect me from the infected. From meeting the odd survivor while moving from place to place, I was told of hordes gathering in large numbers and sweeping through towns and cities. They described some to be larger and stronger than the average human, like maybe the infected are mutating and getting stronger than I was, or than I was used to, in the early stages of my stay here, uh, when they were slower and easier to kill. I heard some survivors fortifying or building bases and farms to try to sur survive off the land. Also, keep an eye out for some survivor vehicles. They seem These seem to be people that already knew what was coming and prepared their car <laughs> with good supplies. Looks like they didn't make it either. You may have to force your way into these, into these ones. Remember to stockpile for winters growing. For winter, as growing crops and fishing is almost impossible to make sure... You have the correct clothing. It can get real cold out here. Oh, great. There's rumors of radiation toxic zones on the island. That's kind of neat. Uh, keep an eye out for a gas mask in your travels. Uh, well, well, Survivor, I wish you all the best. Stay safe out there. Bob Hardy. That is kind of neat. 
uh, it's got a nice, it's got a good storyline. So let me take a look over here. What can I do to get into this house? I see a window here. Oh, that's freaking awesome. Oh, I did get in the house. I wonder if I could have done that at the other house that I found. That's pretty cool. Is there any zombies in here? I was just curious. I really don't want to fight them if I don't have to. So let's see what we got. Uh, yellow trainers. I'm going to hold on to my black boots. There's a suitcase right here. Okay, black gloves. And I think I already have them. And a black shirt. So let me look at my inventory. Can I wear this? Equip. Okay, we got gloves on. Okay, only the luggage. I was hoping I could search these shelves, but it doesn't look like you can. Can't get upstairs. Here's a kitchen. What is that? Can of tuna. Okay, we'll take that. There's a refrigerator. Nothing in there. Is there anything over here? It's just really hard to see. Can I open this door from the outside or from the inside to get out? Yes. That's pretty cool. All right, we searched everything in here. All right, that's good. It's good that you, to know that you can do stuff like that, you know, to get into the house. So let's look at the map again. That's where I'm supposed to be heading, and I kind of am going that way. Um, I know I've got a car, you know, that I'm working on, but obviously all the parts are not here. Oh, there's a zombie. How is this going to work? Try punching. All right, we're going to go on. Oh, he hit me. That's right, I forgot I can kick him. Well, we took out a zombie without a weapon. Just our fists. So that's the first one that we've seen. I'll take, uh, what is that? I don't even know what that is. Oh, old cereal. Painkillers? Hell yeah, there's a knife. Yes. We got his knife, number four. Okay, we got, his, we got our first weapon. So what is this little truck here? This is actually, uh, the game's kind of growing on me. I mean, uh, I was not... If you know, you've never seen me really play these kind of games before because I'm not a fan, like I said. And what is over here that there's a road? But, I mean, it is fun. It is fun, and, and I do like going out here to explore. Now, I don't know if I'm going the right way. This looks like a trail or a pathway or a driveway. And it looks like I'm going up a mountain. Oh, there's another house here. See, I can't really see. Oh, crap. Okay, there's a few of them. Let's get a little closer. Okay. Can you search these dudes? Not that I'm, you know, just curious. All right, we got one. And there's, there's more coming. Let's get in a little closer. Okay. All right, well, we got a couple of them. That's kind of neat. Can we get up underneath here and see? There we go. Doors open. See, I like that I'm, I can, it zooms you in when you go into the house. <clears throat> There's another knife here. I'll take that too. We got a kitchen knife. So we got two knives now. I see the kitchen knife durability looks really, really low. Search cupboard. Okay, we got more painkillers. Do they stack? They do. And we got a candy bar. What was that right there? You got to keep your eye open. Like there could be something here and I just can't see it. But I don't know. Maybe they wouldn't, maybe they wouldn't do it like that. Knowing that, uh, you can't see. Okay, we got another barn here. <laughs> My guy walking with his arms all flopping out. Uh, okay, we got another zombie. Let's go ahead and... The zoom in is kind of weird to work. It, 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 it like it, It's the opposite direction of what I think it would be. Damn, took his head off. Like to scroll out, you actually like are scrolling in. I'm going to take this stuff. These guys all look different, which is kind of neat. Okay. Alright, there was definitely a lot of them here. Oh, there's a van here, too. There's a lot of houses here. Ooh. Whoa, 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 whoa. I don't know if my knife will break. If, oh, crap. If it starts getting really bad. It's possible. We got water. Okay, let me do this really quick. So I can see my water, my food is at 53, my water is at, my health is at 80. So let's do this. We can eat this. I think you eat the water bottle or drink. Open. 
Okay, yeah, I'm drinking it. So let's see what my uh, my thirst went up to 100. <laughs> he dropped the bottle. That's fine. Let's uh, we got two apples. Any? E let's eat this candy bar. And it gets my health or my uh, food up to 72. Okay. There's a door here. Ooh. That was like more food. Dog food. I'm going to leave that alone. Okay, we don't want that. Man, I hate to get trapped in here with zombies out there. Oh, there we go. We got a green hoodie. Green, green white hoodie. Green hoodie. Let's take the green one. It's more camouflaged. There's something here. Oh, it's a bed. I see a bathroom there. There's another door here. Does that door open to the outside? Well, obviously. I mean, I didn't know if it was locked and I don't know. Okay, we got more rope. I'll take that. And that looks like about it. It looks like I, I can get through the windows too if I really wanted to. Um, can we search the counters? We can. Box of matches and some peanut butter. Oh, what the hell? I'm stuck. <laughs> Okay, let me zoom out a little bit. Let's see what else we're dealing with in this local area. Let's get over to this barn. Maybe we can find uh, gas or something like that. Okay. It's a big open barn. Hopefully there are no zombies in here. Okay, we got a car battery. Bottle of purifying tabs. Uh, let's do this. Empty can and... Bottle of liquor are going over there. I already have the screwdriver. I want the purifying tabs. And we got a car battery. So basically, if we, if we found a fan belt and gas, you know, we could drive that vehicle away. Is that the only uh, container in here? I think so. All right. And obviously, you know, this is a first look, so I don't plan on uh, going back for that van at all. I'm just trying different things. And uh, let's. So we came up to the top of that driveway over here. I don't see any. The only other buildings are coming up this direction. So let's run down this way. All right, we're back on the road. And I don't know how far up. Let me just zoom out as much as I can, just so I can kind of see what's coming up around me. Because, you know, if I was in first person mode, I could kind of just look down the road. What is that right there? I think that's a rock. Yeah, let's leave that alone. So where are we on the map? We are actually coming up to the next place. Fairly quick. Okay, ooh, we got zombies. We got cars. All right, let's zoom in a little bit. The problem is I can't see how many zombies because <laughs> I'm so zoomed out. But let's take care of this guy here. Is that a police uh, zombie? I think so. Uh, and like I said, I wonder if you can you can't really search the zombies. All right, what do you got here? We got a small wrench. That's the only thing I got. The only room I got left. Oh, here's a police car. Oh my god. We got a shotgun. We don't have any ammo. Let me give the shot let me give them the wrench. This, this, this. I'm gonna get all these parts out of here. The other stuff I hold on to. But all, all the all the all the crafting material, I'm not going to hold on. I don't have any shotgun rounds in there. Okay. But, uh, yeah, all the other material, because I'm not going to really be doing any crafting. Oh, what the hell? Okay, we got more than one. So, I've only been fighting one at a time, so... Oh, come on, come on, come on. He dropped something on the ground. I saw it right there. Sir, oh, you can search him. He's got a freaking pistol. Okay. Oh, that was the cop. Okay, okay. That's kind of neat. I'm glad I was able to do that. that. That definitely makes it realistic. You know that he's that he's got a gun on him. Okay, we're let's zoom out a little bit more. The game is fun. I'll give it that. It is fun. For me, it's just, ooh man, it's just a little annoying. You know the angle. Okay, what just happened? 
Oh, I got a, I got an award. <laughs> Okay, this guy got look like his rain jack. Oh, he hit me again, damn it. Okay, that's two. Let's zoom out a little bit so I can kind of look. Oh my god, there's like two more over there. Out of the woods. I, I couldn't imagine what like a large city in this game might be like. Where there could be like, you know, 15, 20 of them coming at me. Now, if I had a gun, it'd be alright. So let's see here what, what we got in the van. We got oil. Bottle purifying tabs. You can't stack these? Oh, okay. Let me put two of them back. And we got oil. Pretty flammable stuff. Could probably combine with something. Yeah, you could probably take that oil and make like Molotov cocktails or something like that. What the hell am I? Okay, we got a huge town coming up. Huge. That's what it looks like anyway. Let's uh, <laughs> slide on over here. Hey, where the hell is it? Oh, I see. I see it. It's all off the road. Maybe it's a barn or a farm. No. Okay, there it is. Okay, wow. Look at all this place. Can I jump over this fence? What the hell? Oh, I made a little tiny noise and they busted out the window. All right, let's just go around. I don't know if I can get over this fence. Oh, I can. They are coming out of the windows. Oh, man. All right, let's get around the corner in case I need to run. Okay, we got one. Oh, crap. So I gotta be careful, man. If my knife breaks, I'm gonna be without a weapon. Because I don't have any ammo for the other stuff. Okay, there's two right there. Let's, let's get over here and search this. Come on, man. Search the trailer. Cashew nuts. We'll leave them alone. Looks like it's getting dark, too. Oh, crap. Oh, man. Well, I can search him. He had something. I want to search him. Stay on the ground. He's not dead. Oh, my God. I'm facing the wrong way. See, that's why I don't like about this. What was that? We got a lockpick and a drink. Oh, man. See, I'm facing the wrong way again. Come on. <laughs> They have something there, too. There's just a couple things to search. Let me search this one right here. Painkillers and a bottle of whiskey or something. Hey, what did the other one have? Okay, that was that one. All right, we already searched him. Can I get in through this door? Okay, we're going to go through the window that they climbed out of. So they were, they were in the house, but they climbed out. Okay, I see a drink here. I see it looks like food, tomato soup. Uh, a jar of jam, a can of tuna. Oh, crap. Ooh. Let me get the hell out of here. Get out the window. <laughs> oh, let me get over the fence. Hell no. Oh, he's going around. Okay, so they can't jump the fence. That's good to know. Oh, crap. Oh, man, I thought he was dead. Level up. Okay, what does that mean? I'm on my red. Am I infected? Oh, man. Okay, let me do this. Let's see here. What do we got? Painkillers. Let me treat. All right. 37 health. Maybe I was bleeding or something. Can I do another one? We got painkillers and a bottle of purifying tab. Yeah, that purifying tab is not going to... So give me 37. Yeah, I get 10 points for every one of these painkillers I take. 10 points of health back. All right. I'd really like to find some ammo. What do we got? We got lots of houses. Oh, come on, man. I can't. I'm trying to back up when I hit him or when I swing at him. 
<laughs> Ooh, that, that one there's got some weird stuff on his back. Oh, he's got a backpack. He's got a backpack. Why well, has there got to be two of them at the same time? Oh, no, 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 no. Get back. I want to check that backpack out. Oh, get out of the way. All right, hold on, hold on. 21 health. Is my, am I, is my health dropping? Back up, dude. I can't freak. Oh, they got me. They got me. I was like, I couldn't hit them. All right. Well, that was our first look. It looks like a fun game. I, you know, obviously, I'm not playing it the way it, it's actually supposed to be played because I don't know what the hell I'm doing. <laughs> but it's the first look. It's for me to check the game out, and this way you can kind of see it too. But, uh, yeah, that'll, that'll kind of do it here for this episode. Thank you so much for watching. I do appreciate it, and I will catch you guys next week.